Hi there, kids. Welcome to Sunday School for this week. Um, I'm wearing this crown today because I've been thinking a lot about kings and what the word king means to us today. We don't really have a king, but we maybe think of chess. If you play chess, there's a king in chess or checkers or maybe you read a lot of fantasy books and there's kings and queens and books you've read. But in today's story, we're going to be thinking about Jesus as the king and what that means for us to live in Jesus's kingdom. Before we do that, let's do some singing. Today we learn about a very sad and hard day for Jesus when all his friends left him and the leaders were treating him very badly. But even though the leaders were treating Jesus like dirt, he was still the king over all kings. And three days later, God raised him up to be the great king in glory. Alleluia! I think that when the people on earth were treating Jesus so badly, the angels in heaven were singing about who Jesus really is, the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Glory! Alleluia! Let's sing those words now. Sometimes we feel alone or sad or we have troubles. Jesus wants us to know that he had troubles too and he understands us. You can sing this song to remind yourself that Jesus is walking with us all the time, especially when we're sad. You can always ask him for help. Today's story is called Christ the King. The priests were mad at Jesus and wanted to get rid of him. What will happen to us if people follow Jesus, they grumbled. So they made a plan. Let's take Jesus to the governor, Pontius Pilate. He can get rid of Jesus. When Pontius Pilate saw Jesus, he asked, Are you the king of the Jews? Jesus didn't answer. Pilate thought kings ruled over countries and people. Jesus knew that his power was about loving God. Jesus' kingdom was not the same. Pilate was frustrated. Some people wanted to kill Jesus, but Pilate didn't think that Jesus had done anything wrong. Pilate didn't want any trouble, so he handed Jesus over to the people. The priests smiled. Soon Jesus would be gone. Jesus knew that he would die, but that wouldn't be the end of the story. Jesus knew God's plan, too. Hey, kids! Your activity for this week is to be a spy. Find out everything you can about King Jesus. 
Look around for signs that his kingdom might be coming. Or might already be here. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be my name. Thy kingdom comes. Thy will be done. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the power. The Glory forever and ever. Amen. Good morning, kids. Today we're going to open egg number six. Inside you'll find fish. The fish was a symbol for the early Christians who followed Jesus and learned to serve others. So use this fish as a reminder to serve others. 